I'm going to do a quick CD of the week before we get into the topic, and it is Joy's topic this week. Now, this one is very topical, though you will probably be listening to this a few weeks after the fact, so it might not be quite as topical. Okay. Uh, this week's CD of the week is Kate Bush, and it's the compilation album, The Whole Story. Okay. Now, the reason that I've decided to, um, to feature Kate Bush this week, it's like the entire world woke up and discovered Kate Bush. Now, I know of Kate Bush. I've got a number of her albums. She's a fantastic singer. She's a fantastic songwriter. She's had hits throughout the years, grew up with her music, et cetera, et cetera. Um, our listener, Megan Osmond, is a massive fan of Kate Bush. You know, it, people love Kate Bush. However, it seems to be everyone collectively either didn't know of Kate Bush or forgot about her. But what happened is this Stranger Things Netflix mm -hmm. series, which I must say I have not seen. But people I've seen tell the first me that. Season. Yeah, I've not seen it because we don't have Netflix, but um, people watch it and have really enjoyed it. They feature the track running up that hill in an episode or episodes. And then it's like the entire world went, what's this amazing, fabulous music? And then it's like the number one song streamed on Spotify and NPR are doing articles about Kate Bush. And well, it's weird. That whole stranger. So Charlie watched the first season and me and him really, neither of us were like, it wasn't our thing. Like we just weren't really into it, but it's based in the eighties and you know, it's like the kids or whatever. And something about every episode matches up with a D and D game, but I can't confirm that, but the soundtrack is really good. And that's one of the selling points of the TV show that's playing on like this eighties thing. Right. That's what they're okay. going for. So that's why she comes into it. Just explaining why Kate Bush is now skyrocketing again. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, but may maybe, I mean, she was big in the UK. And, you know, growing up, there was always Kate Bush songs. And also the song, um, I think it, it, it's Wuthering Heights, actually. Mm -hmm. Wuthering Heights is featured in I'm Alan Partridge when Alan Partridge comes into uh, the Travel Tavern and sings it to Susan behind the desk. And it's yep. been parodied off of that and things like that. So even outside of the fact she maybe hasn't had a hits for a few years, certainly in the UK, people know who Kate Bush are. What I wouldn't she, say I she's that large here. I mean, I do know who she is, but I do think she probably has a larger UK following. So maybe it's opening it up to the American market. Maybe. Stranger things. But, well, I'm glad it is because, I mean, there's some really good music. And as I said, I have a mm -hmm. number of her albums, but I decided to feature this sort of best of. I said you've got Wuthering Heights, Cloud Bus Thing, The Man with the Child in His Eyes, Hounds of Love, Running Up the Hill, of course, is on here. The Dreaming, Babushka. I mean, it's not on this album, but she also does a cover of Rocket Man, which is absolutely fantastic. I've heard that before too. Yeah. It so, is good. So I would say to our listeners and viewers, if you're not familiar with Kate Bush, even if you just dip into the Kate Bush universe by getting this, the whole story uh, compilation album, I do highly recommend it. Yeah. I mean, I like her. I do think she was more popular in the UK. I think I found out about her probably later, but I definitely agree. Also, like, um, I have heard her version of Rocket Man, and it's great. Um, so, yeah. Well, there we are. Well, there, well, ladies and gentlemen, there we are. That's our CD of the week, and that's Kate Bush, the whole story. And before Tim cuts this from YouTube, I'm sorry, everyone, I look like I'm melting. It's because I am. I have to turn the AC off, so don't judge my hair. <laughs> Joy, you are absolutely fine. You are you are amongst friends on this podcast, and even our YouTube viewers, you are amongst friends. Everything is fair fine. enough. All right, <laughs> so on to the episode.